Thank you for joining us. We'll be reviewing a selection of products from the Golden System of Acrylics. To start, we'll take a look at the four acrylic color lines offered by Golden. Open acrylics are uniquely formulated slow drying acrylics that are slightly softer than heavy body acrylics. The slow drying time is ideal for shading, blending, and subtle transitions. Open acrylics are also great for printmaking. Heavy body acrylics are the flagship of the Golden line, offering a large assortment of pure pigments with clean color mixing and a smooth, buttery consistency. They offer excellent permanency and light fastness with no fillers, extenders, opacifiers, toners, or dyes. Highly versatile fluid acrylics have a pigment load and intensity equal to Golden Heavy Body Acrylics, but with a leveling characteristic useful for brush application, fine detail, pouring, spraying, staying, and other techniques. Notice how they flow, but not run quickly down the page. Fluids are great for adding color to mediums, gessos, and grounds. High flow acrylics have an ink-like consistency that lends itself to a wide range of techniques, including staining, calligraphy, fine line, and mixed media. They work well on a range of tools, from refillable markers and dip pens to airbrushes. The colors match perfectly across color lines and can be intermixed easily. Before we move on, see how the thinner areas of the heavy body paints are now dry or almost dry, while the open acrylics still remain quite workable due to the slower drying time. Each color family also includes iridescent and interference colors. These are non-fading, non-tarnishing metallic finishes that can be mixed with standard colors to create a shimmering, lustrous, pearlescent effect. Now we're going to see some examples of mediums, gels, and pastes, and how they mix with color. We'll start with polymer medium, which is basically unpigmented acrylic paint. Since polymer medium has a fluid consistency, it will increase the softness and leveling of heavy body paints. The more medium used, the greater the transparency and gloss. But due to the high pigment load of golden paints, only a small amount of paint is needed to create transparent colors. When polymer medium is used to extend fluid acrylics, it will increase gloss and transparency, but not impact the feel of the paint to the same degree, since those two products have very similar viscosity and consistency. Gel mediums offer many ways to extend color or build texture and are available in a range of consistencies and sheens. Soft gel gloss is a little thinner than heavy body paints and can be used to extend colors to create brilliant glazes. Peaks or tool marks will relax as the gel dries. Both soft gel gloss and gloss medium can be used as adhesives for collage or mixed media. Heavy gel matte, on the other hand, is thicker than heavy body paints and can be blended with colors to increase body while giving them more of a matte finish. Peaks or marks will hold it better as compared to soft gel. Light molding paste is a product that dries to an opaque matte finish. It blends easily with color and is able to hold stiff peaks for a highly textured surface. Its light weight is beneficial when creating large textured pieces. Light molding paste is also wonderfully absorbent and is excellent as a ground. Glass bead gel made with genuine glass beads creates a less absorbent, bumpy texture. When applied thinly, the glass beads will reflect light. These are just a few examples of the many gels and pastes that can be used alone or mixed with paint to modify texture and sheen. Gels, mediums, and paste can also make excellent surfaces or grounds for painting. Here we have two dry sample boards, one with light molding paste and one with fiber paste. We're going to wet half of each board and show how golden high flow and fluid paints react differently on each surface. High flow acrylics produce intense color washes due to their high pigment load. Observe how the cream-like consistency of fluid acrylics reacts differently on the wet surface compared to the spreading color of high flow acrylics. The choice of fluid acrylics or high flow acrylics depends on the effects you desire. High flow acrylics create beautiful blooms, but offer less control than fluid acrylics. On a dry surface, both high flow and fluid colors act in a more controlled manner. But see how the high flow color spreads, making a fatter mark than the fluid color. High flow acrylics respond differently than fluid acrylics on different grounds. Even after the paint has been applied, the high flow color will continue to move. Before we finish, let's take a closer look at a product that is unique to Golden, open, slow drying acrylics. Open slow drying acrylics are unique because they remain wet for extended periods of time without skinning over, which makes them a great choice for water-based printmaking. We've used molding paste to make a nice smooth surface with low absorbency that works well as a printing plate and also as a surface for subtractive techniques. 
Squeeze a dab of open acrylics onto the dried molding paste and then evenly spread it out. Using any tool you prefer, create a drawing using a subtractive technique. Then take a piece of paper and firmly press it into the molding paste and burnish the back. Peel the paper up to see your print. If you have any questions about this video or our products, contact Golden Product Support at help at goldenpaints.com.